Hey guys, this is Pharaoh2091, and welcome back to Let's Play Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trials and Tribulations. Last time we left off, we found out the sacred urn was stolen! Who would do such a thing? It turns out it's supposedly Mask the Mask. I hope I say his name right, but... Eh, I never care. So now we actually met Luke Atme, self-proclaimed Ace Detective. Let's see what he has to say about all this stuff. I just, just don't like his attitude. Ugh. Um, so are you really as famous as you say? Of course! For a lawyer, you have a rather shocking lack of knowledge about the world. I had no idea anyone was left in the city that had not heard of me. Look at me! I am Mask the Mask Arch Enemy, the Ace Detective Loot at me! At this moment, those are... these are... Ugh, there are two mighty figures which loom large over this grand city. One embodies the nefarious forms of dark... forces of darkness, the other the angelic cherubs of light! Boy, now I'm really lost. What is he saying, Nick? I have been personally on the heels of this villain since his first crime. After learning this criminal's patterns, I thwarted his very late... his very latest lo loathsome larceny. I have returned the target of his tyranny, a portrait of Magina, to the crime scene. I did it all by myself! I took it back from Mask the Mask, with my brawny mind and my brilliant muscles. Yeah, they mentioned on the news in the Great People of the Town segment. They said that the museum gave you an incredible jewel as a reward. <laughs> well, compared to the treasure that I ret retreat for them, it's not much. So, in the end, the only thing that, this ma that makes you great is your own self-praise? Pretty much. Oh, tell us what you know about Mask the Mask, and keep it simple, please. Like about how I have devoted my left to thwarting his dastardly deeds? Last night, here in the bowels of this store, we were locked in the most glorious ba battle. I see. Uh-huh? Hang on a second. You were here last night? Here? In Lordly Taylor? Naturally! Wherever Mas the Masco goes, you will find Atme laying his elegant traps. Elegant traps? More like the mask out elegance you and made a beautiful getaway. But this time, I allowed him to escape with the illusion of victory. I wonder if I should ask him about what happened last night in more detail. Yeah, why not? We need to find out more, don't we? Um, can you tell us exactly what happened here last night? But of course! After all, I always say, I always say there should be no secrets between aces. Flyer will get you nowhere, Pinocchio. I first received the request for my services 20 days ago. And it was 10 days ago that we received Mask the Mask's calling card. Huh? You were hired before the calling card even arrived? Yes. You see, the person who hired me is uh, quite rigorous and thorough. Well, that's Adrian for you. A mere 10 days after hiring me, her worst permit permissions were realized. A calling card arrived, right? Yes! So, ace detective that I am, I set a trap for a thief right in the warehouse. And waited for him. Alone. Alone? But why? What? Excuse me. Why didn't you go to the police for help? Ridiculous! Why would I seek help from such a singularity useless group of nincompoops? You've got a lot of nerve. After all, it was you that let the mask get away. I always operate alone and concealed. All these sight of others. Corn sealed? Precisely. Even the guards on duty here were unaware of my presence. To fool your enemies, first you must fool your friends. It's my own original proverb. Anyway, back to what happened last night. As I was saying, I hid here in a warehouse and waited for the fleet to arrive. But I swear to you, not a solitary soul came through that entrance. Nevertheless, the sacred urn disappeared! But that's impossible! How could it just disappear? How, you ask? Oh, don't be ridiculous, sir lawyer. If I knew to answer that question, I wouldn't be here! For someone who seriously messed up his own stakeout, he is rather full of himself. So you're saying that even though one came, th one came through the doll's doors last night, our precious urn still somehow vanished from under your nose? I think she meant to say no one, I, unless I didn't see that. 
That's just not possible. It isn't. Something is going on here. Well, you can already see from the going through the crime scene, you see some things have changed here. So, I'm gonna go ahead and examine the first thing is uh, the sword right here. It's just out there. What is it doing all the way here? Sir Lawyer, please refrain from such crude behavior. How? What do you mean? This criminal is an artist! The crime scene is a canvas upon which he paints. Only I, Institute of Atme, have an eye which is educated enough to read the signs. Could you translate that for me, Nick? I think he pretty much said, don't touch anything, amateurs. If there's anything you wish to know about, you have but to ask at me. I know everything there is to know about my rival, Mask the Mask. What do I do now? Does he have any top secret information? Stuff that only a real crime buff would know? I'll think about what to ask while I listen to what Mr. Ace the Detective has to say. Hmm. So, he's not... Essentially, he's not gonna let us talk or touch anything. Hmm, let me just see. I might keep examining real quick here. Yeah, because I'm gonna keep saying the same thing. So essentially, I might have to go ahead and present something to him to make him talk. What is something I could present? Perhaps a calling card? Mess to mess calling card. It's got his emblem printed on it, right? Quite impressive! But I would expect nothing less from my arch rival. I'm surprised to see you in prof and see you in profession of such a top secret piece of information. Well, we've got an ace lawyer, an ace spirit medium, and an ace cousin apprentice here. Yes, indeed. I think I could learn to like you, my fellow ace professionals. I don't know if I really want this guy to like us. Ever. Well, sir lawyer, I've been told that you too are pursuing a mysterious thief. Well, I'm not sure that's- That's right! We're gonna find a sacred honor no matter what we have to do! Excellent. I will trust you. I permit you to take a look around while I invest I'll investigate elsewhere. If, perchance, you should discover something of value, then return them to my office. To my office of Earthly Delights, the Atme Detective Agency. Office of Earthly Delights? Well then, Sir Lawyer, if you'll excuse me, I have much to do. Yes, yes, goodbye, Pinocchio. Wait a minute! He's gone. I don't like the idea of doing this guy's work for him. Well, come on, Nick. Don't worry about it. It's no big deal. Let's hurry and investigate before he changes his mind. I want to go to his office, too. Take me with you, okay? Uh, whatever. Well, now we can go ahead and examine. We just have to get him out of our way. So now let's go ahead and examine the sword. Wow, this is awesome! What did Miss Andrews say it was called again? Blah! It's literally seven, literally seven branch sword in Japanese. Or so says Miss Andrews. Whoa, it's pretty heavy. One hit, seven times the fun. <laughs> pretty catchy, huh? I bet it sell like hotcakes. Um, there's something about it that bothers me though. Wow, you're really firing on all firing on all cylinders today, Pearly. The sword wasn't Mystic Amy holding it last night. Oh, that's true. And another thing, that sword wasn't bent last time like it is now. You're right. Awesome, Pearly. I wouldn't expect any less from my little ace apprentice. The sword is bent, so that must mean. Last night, someone used it somehow. Aha! I just thought of something! Maybe Detective Atme smashed Mask the Mask with it! Like this! Yo! What the hell? What do you think, Pearly? I think it's even more bent than it was before. Oh man, my head! My hair! <laughs> That's all he cares about. Oh, gee, come on, Maya, what? honestly, are you that stupid you have to smack me like that? Ah, well, what else can we examine? How about the gold statue? I mean, I don't remember it being here. 
this statue of Mystic Amy is so cool. I want a gold statue of myself. We could put it in the office. Hey, it's right in company. How about a gold statue of me? Um, Mr. Nick, I'm sorry, but I noticed something strange. Huh? What is it, Pearls? The statue of Mystic Amy... Was there... was it... was this where it was last night? Oh! I'm pretty sure it was closer to the door. Yeah, I think you're right. Great job, Pearly! I wouldn't expect anything less from my ace cousin. So the statue was moved on the night of the crime. That's another clue. So what the hell is it moved? Hmm. What the hell's this? Look what you did, Nick! You spilled paint all, all over here! I didn't do that! Well, it wasn't here last night. I would have noticed the color. That or out that outrageous. But this paint has already dried up. Well then, you should have cleaned up before it dried, Nick. Paint doesn't dry that fast. Besides, I told you it wasn't me. It looks like it's been several days since it was split. What split? I mean, spilt. Shit, yeah, spilt, not split. Hey, wait, look at this. What is it? There's some kind of shape left on the bottom left side of the stain. Huh? Oh, you're right. I wonder what it could be. Huh. Perhaps we'll find out later. And what's this? This wasn't here before either. That pathetic looking wooden box. Hey! That's the box that had a sacred urn in it! Ah, uh, don't touch it! There may be clues in the, in the th to the thief's identity in the, out on there. Ugh. Worked so hard to make that box. Huh? You made that poor excuse for her box, Maya? What's that supposed to mean? That urn has always been it's been on its stand in a winding way of a Fay Manor. So there was no box suitable for it, Mr. Nick. And I, I was so proud of it. <sighs> poor Maya. Maybe it'd been better if Mess the Mess had taken a box too. And maybe it would have been better if he didn't say, "Oh, that's a crappy looking box." And to her face, you made that crappy box? Come on, Phoenix. He doesn't, he doesn't make any sense. What's this computer right here? Name's the security uh, computer. It has data on it. Hey, Pearly, do you know what this is? It's a computer. A computer. Oh, I've heard of those. It has such a cute name. It looks like this computer is for sorting, sto uh, storing the data from the security camera. If someone comes in or out of the warehouse, the camera takes a photo of them. It's probably the trap the detective set up. Let's see if we can find last night's data on this thing. You might even find a photo of Mask the Mask. Hmm. Let's see here. Oh man, I really, I really stink at working these things. Then you would not be able to handle my line of work. <laughs> or my line of degree at the moment. What's wrong, Mr. Nick? You're sweating an awful lot. I don't know how to pull up the photos. I had no idea you were so pathetic with high-tech stuff, Nick. Yeah, well, I managed to print out the camera data anyway. I guess you have to learn to crawl before you can walk, right, Nick? Yeah, sure. Anyway, it looks like the camera only went off once last night. Hmm, okay. But we, we don't know if the, we don't actually have a picture with us. Okay, well, I think that's all we can do here. Let's just head back now. Oh, someone's calling. Oh, Nick, your cell phone's ringing. Hello, Phoenix right here. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh it's me, Gumshoe. Gumshoe? What is it? What's so funny? Oh, I'll tell you what's funny, pal. I finally beat him. I beat Mr. Ace Detective. Finally! This underdog is the alpha dog today. That stuck-up detective's met his match. Yep. I finally caught him. Lock, stock, and barrel. <laughs> There's no escape for him. You caught him? Are you saying... You... You captured Mask of the Mask? Bingo! Well, actually, he surrendered. But I still got him! Mask the Mask surrendered? That's great! So when can we come pick up the Sacred Urn? Um, uh, well, you see, 
I was gonna tell you... What? Something wrong? Do you think you can swing by the detention center sometime? Detention center? He wants to talk to you. Mask the mask, that is. What? He wants to talk to Nick? I'll be waiting for you, pal, so get over here soon. The detention center, huh? Well, we all know how to get to- Ugh. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Of course, the only way to get to the detention center is by going- Well, through- Actually, I probably could have- Well, we we, uh, we can go to the Atmius office by, by going from the Lordly Taylor, or from here. But now nah, we can actually go to the detention center. I don't know why they stand and they make a static. Game. We all know how it looks like. But next time, guys, we're gonna go ahead and uh, see why we're here at the detention center. So, as usual, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time for Let's Play Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trials and Tribulations. I'll see you guys later.